Hey everyone, welcome to Denver Scene Pie channel. Yay, I'm Sabina. My name is Alex. And today we're watching 19th episode of the third season of Attack on Titan. The decision was made. Armin is saved, Erwin is dead. Yes, that was really a hard moment and probably a very hard decision for Levi. But yay, Armin will be alive soon again. Yeah, we can look at the positive side. Of course, we lost a very important character, Erwin, who could really bring the value and maybe even change the world. However, if there is a choice between either one of them dead or both of them dead, in this case, it's probably the best scenario when at least one of them is saved. Yes, and plus Armin, I think it's a lot of potential in him. He's a really smart guy and he did a lot of things already that helped scouts to be at that moment. Plus, Erwin was really tired. He had a very tough life and probably it was a mercy from Levi just to let him go. Yeah, it's sad he never got to this basement that we talk a lot about. But maybe we'll go to this basement soon, maybe in this episode. Hopefully, that's the name of the episode. Yeah, I have a lot of... <laughs> A lot of hopes about it. Let's get it started. Yay. Is it Bertolt talking? No idea. Is it the nightmare? Looks so. Crying colossal titan. Since when Armin has this type of body? She was in training for like a year or so already, I think. Okay. He saved your life. Yeah, what Armin would think if he will know that they just chose him over Erwin. I think he'll cry. Hanja lost an eye. Wow, everybody else died. And Rainer's still alive. It's fine. Aaron did worse, he ate his father. Yeah, not the best dish you can imagine. お前の仲良し<笑> I think Irvin would be more logical decision. I still think so. エルヴィンが注射を託したのはリヴァイであり、そのリヴァイは君を選んだ。君にはエルヴィンの命と巨人の力が託され、君はもうそういう存在なんだ。New life of Armin. Colossal Armin. Oh yeah, sounds good. お前じゃエルヴィンの代わりにはなれねえ。人にはない力を持っていることも確かだ。俺は後悔するつもりはない。こいつらを後悔させるな。お前自身も後悔させるな。私とリヴァイ。エレンとミカサで調査に向かう。Investigation on the basement, I believe. Oh yeah, finally. People were waiting for years for this episode. Well, I waited long enough as well. So suspenseful music. Yeah, there's a lot of memories. Yeah, it's probably very sad to walk at the place that was full of life and memories and now it's just destroyed and empty. Yeah, depressing. Hannes. Always drunk. <laughs> it's a tough job to keep everybody safe in the walls. Oh, yeah. <laughs> They're making it so dark. They're extending the moment as much as they can. That's true. Show me the basement. Whoa. Yeah, that place seems scary. Oh, I wish Erwin could be there as well. Erwin. 
Something is wrong. That's weird. Yeah, just break it. But still, what was wrong with the key? Maybe it's key for something else? Hmm. Yeah, maybe some hidden room. Oh, could be. And that the key to the hidden room. Ooh, they found it. That's funny, everybody need to tell him. <laughs> Aaron. What? Empty? Ooh. Books. Damn. The books with secrets. Please just open it.壁の外に人類がいないって人類が壁の外をろくに出歩けない以上は人類が巨人に食いつくされたことを歴史書は食いつくされたと断言している歴史書というのは客観的であるべきで食いつくされたと思われると表記するのが正しいはずだ言葉
to like hide from tyrants. Of course, our walls, it's not only one society that exists. Uh, Emir is proof of that. She wasn't from there, but she also had people around and tyrants issue as well. Yeah, and our titan trio, well, plus Annie, they're also not from inside the walls. They're from somewhere else as well. So there could be not even one society outside the walls. It could be multiple societies, mm -hmm. as you said, with their technologies, their own culture, everything. Yeah, I'm curious if other societies still have technology technologies because titans are still a thing so they're probably everywhere not just in in one place around the world <laughs> that could be weird hmm, i'm curious if there are any society that still have technologies because seems like all this titan thing made people go back if there's somebody still having all that and only those people live in the walls that's that's pretty wild yeah what do you think of titans now what are they the secret of basement still not revealed. I saw the picture. I, I'm aware of picture existing. <laughs> I was expecting something more, maybe about Titans, how it all works. No, they just opened one page. Yeah, they're like, <laughs> whoa, that's insane. What will be on the next one? A rap album or something? <laughs> So yeah, right now it's really hard to say anything about the Titan thing, but maybe Titans were made to to be able to control people that way they are controlled right now. But it's a very weird manipulation. I don't know who will be able to do that. Beast Titan. That's pretty wild. Yeah, there's a lot of questions. I'm not satisfied with one picture. Yeah, that's the beauty of Attack on Titan. They're revealing one secret and opening up two or three different things that there is no answer for them, even close one for now, just theories. But I can assure you that everything will be answered. That's a good thing. Also, I'm thinking like Grisha. I'm pretty sure he was pretending he can't remember anything. You still think so? Yeah, I'm still thinking this way. And place where he lived before, it was also destroyed. Or he went from a normal society to this place. Yeah, not clear yet. And in the end of these post credits, they also said, well, the narrator said uh, with Grisha's voice that that day uh, opened the eyes to the world for me. So probably next episode we will see what happened on that day. Oh, can't wait to see that. Thank you for watching this episode with us. Like this video if you like it. Subscribe to our channel if you'd like to see our future reactions. Leave a comment below if you have something to tell us, but no spoilers. And thank you for watching. See you in the next one. See ya.